This is Mornington Road in Ashford. Lovely, quiet residential road here. Short distance to local amenities. Got a cluster of uh, shops at the top of the road, more or less, short walk. As you see here, we've got off-street parking to the left-hand side with access to the garage. The driveway has been made to the right-hand side whilst the curb is not dropped. You might find it quite easy to park a second car on there. But actually, the road is particularly quiet, so you're never going to be pushed for parking. It's a nice, quiet, well-regarded residential roads here. As we come through, this property's been recently refurbished by the current owner after the tenant has not long moved out. So as we enter the hallway here, you have bedroom number two immediately on your right-hand side. This would comfortably take a double bed and room for storage and your bedroom furnishings in here. I'll give you a bit of a feel for the dimensions. Here we are. As you move back down the hallway, we've got nice tiles underfoot. Master bedrooms here on the right hand side. Slightly deceiving as it cuts back on itself. A nice little recess there. So, good double bedroom. Again, all new sockets, light fittings above. I suggest that you probably opt for your bed along that wall. Perhaps with the wardrobes on that corner over there. But nice size double. Again, you can check the floor plan for the dimensions, but good double bedroom. So we move down the hallway with the modern fitted bathroom suite here on the right hand side. You see heated towel rail, new toilet sink basin, bath fitting with shower overhead. You've got the handheld shower fitting there and the rainfall shower fitting above. Again, nice clean finish through here. Just across the hallway, really sizable main reception. Nice rectangular shape to this one. It's large enough to kind of accommodate a dining room table, perhaps up one end, and then sitting room at the other. And quite a nice feature with the bay there. So it's a little bit echoey because there's no furnishings currently. Nonetheless, nice big reception room. You can see it's quite bright, the lights aren't on. There we are. Good living accommodation. Little storage cupboard here on the right hand side. And then we move through to the modern fitted kitchen. So this has all recently been replaced. See, nice white tops there. Gas hob, plenty of storage space. Space for appliances there under the hob. And your boiler's house in that cupboard on the left hand side there. Nice finish again throughout. And it would comfortably take room for a little breakfast table as well. As we move out here, sort of undecorated room if you like. This will be labeled as a lean to on the description. Really, this is just the back half of the garage, if you like. I think you could probably do something a little more with this. Maybe making it an extension to the kitchen, a little utility area perhaps with a, a worktop across there. Or, well, you know, maybe a little bit unorthodox, but perhaps an office. And the garage is retained in its original, in its original layout here. Nothing of interest, but you know, decent size. And we move out to the rear garden. Fairly shallow, something like 15 to 20 foot in depth that runs the width of the property. Whilst you can't access the front from this right hand side, you do have access back to the front along this side here. As you can see, you can make your way back. You might choose to have a gate there or something for a little bit more privacy. But nonetheless, shallow garden, minimal fuss, just a little bit of maintenance. You might opt to have a little lawn or something, but just paving stones underneath currently. So there we are. A little bit of sun filtering in here, as you can see on the floor. Sun setting just behind, so currently filming this at quarter to five. Probably a sort of westerly facing garden, I would say, judging by where the sun is currently. So, yeah, you're going to see sun at the latter part of the afternoon. But, yeah, beautifully 
finished two double bedroom attached bungalow in this quiet residential spot well regarded residential location off street parking for a couple of cars retains the double garage if you're interested in arranging a viewing please contact us in the ashford branch thank you